Ramadan, friends, and salamu alaikum. Welcome to Ramadan Books in Nadia's Nook. Today, we are reading a salamu alaikum by M.S. Kayani. In this story, we get to learn all about saying salamu alaikum. Do you guys know what a salamu alaikum means? That means, may peace be upon you. Now, come on. Join me in your jammies and grab your favorite cuddly friend because it's time for... Ramadan books, Ramadan books, Ramadan books in Nadia's nook. Welcome back to my nook, everyone. Are you guys all comfy in your jammies? Great, me too. Who's ready to read? Bismillah. Let's begin. Assalamu alaikum by M. S. Kayani. My name is Abdullah and my name is Amina. We are Muslims who believe in Islam. That is our faith, and Islam is our way of life. Islam means peace, and it shows us how to live in peace. Allah has given us Islam so that we live in peace with him and everyone around us. Muslims pray for peace for all people, animals, and plants. We live in peace with them all, inshallah, says Abdullah. Yes, we are Muslims and want to live in peace with everyone, says Amina. All Muslims are like one big family. They love each other and are kind to each other. They pray for their Muslim brothers and sisters. When we meet other Muslims, we say assalamu alaikum to them, says Amina. It means peace be upon you, says Abdullah. Muslims say assalamu alaikum when they leave each other as well. When I say Assalamu alaikum to Amina, says Abdullah. I say, Wa alaikum assalam back to Abdullah, says Amina. This means, and peace be upon you too. This is like a prayer to Allah, to ask him to bless each other, to bring peace so that we are happy. We like being Muslims because Islam helps us every day. In the morning, when we wake up, we should say Assalamu Alaikum to our mom and dad and our brothers and sisters. When we do, they all say Wa Alaikum Assalam back to us, says Amina. We all love each other, so we begin each day with the greeting of peace, says Abdullah. When dad leaves the house, he calls out, Assalamu alaikum to us, says Abdullah. And we reply, Wa alaikum assalam to him, says Amina. Peace be with you, and peace be with you too. We both love dad, so we pray to Allah to bless him, say Abdullah and Amina. And dad loves us too. So he prays to Allah to bless us as well. When we leave the house to go to school, we say Assalamu Alaikum to mom and our brothers and sisters, say Amina and Abdullah. And I reply, Wa Alaikum Assalam to them, says mom. Peace be with you all, and peace be with you too. When we come back from school, we greet everyone with Assalamu Alaikum as we go into the house, says Abdullah. And everyone inside says, Wa Alaikum Assalam back to us, says Amina. Peace be with you all, and peace be with you too. Muslims always say Assalamu Alaikum when they meet or leave each other. We always pray for each other 
and wish each other peace and happiness. We do this because our prophet, peace be upon him, did it, and we follow his way, says Amina. This is our way, the way of peace, because we are Muslims, says Abdullah. Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, When you enter a house, say, Assalamu alaikum, because this will bring peace to everyone. He also said, When you enter any place, say, Assalamu alaikum. The Prophet also said, When you meet anyone, if you know him or not, say, Assalamu alaikum, peace be with you. And peace be with you too. Assalamu alaikum, say Abdullah and Amina, and thank you for reading our book. Wasn't that so fun learning all about saying salamu alaikum? I think so too. Today or tomorrow, why don't you try saying assalamu alaikum to as many people as you can? Say it to everyone you see. Inshallah, I can't wait to see you all tomorrow night when we read another book in my nook. Until then, good night and sweet dreams.